And I remind our team every morning we have one job. We want to wake up and we want to see what we can do to create more jobs, high quality jobs, family wage jobs for Tennesseans. It's a wonderful opportunity to get to know our people. You email them all the time, you're making calls to them, getting to be here with them, spend some time with them, uh, strengthens that relationship. And just with ECD alone, we've announced almost 150,000 jobs in our state since the Governor Haslam administration began. Over 700 folks showing up in Gatlinburg, supporting the community, which was really important for us to invest in Gatlinburg and their recovery, and as a symbol, show that we are true partners in this process. My arm and my hand got paralyzed playing a game of football. My commitment level didn't, my purpose didn't. You watch him and the powerful message he speaks, and you go, man, I, I, I let that day slip by, I need to do better next day. When it's all said and done, it's about two things. It's about who we become, and it's about what we give. Anakisa was, was exciting, what a beautiful place to kind of cap off the day, a long day of a breakout session. I thought we would start with a conversation about, let's talk a little bit about what happened in Tennessee to get us where we are now. We are the number one state. I thought this year's governor's conference was a home run. And I say that for several reasons. The content was great. I got good feedback from everyone I talked to. But once again, the most important thing is reminding everybody involved, no matter what part of the state that you're from, that we really are Team Tennessee. Uh, that Tennessee really can lead. We're already leading in so many things when you look at you know, tax and debt and so many different things that we're leading in. We can complete the circle and, and show this is how government can happen. And when I think you bring everybody in that room who's focused on growing jobs in Tennessee, the results are great.